Hey! Thanks so much for checking out my top three awesome camera recommendations for your vlog, which could be your YouTube channel, your website, videos for your social media pages, or any other online video series that you're looking to make. This is part six of a seven part series on how to pick the most awesome camera for your vlog. So if you stumbled upon this episode first, you should go back, take a look at some of the awesome information that I have about cameras that you should consider and cameras that you should stay away from. Also, there's good info on tech specs and lenses. Speaking of lenses, make sure you're subscribed because next week I will be giving my top three awesome lenses for your vlog. Now listen, I don't own or have the cameras that I'm about to recommend. I use a professional grade camera as I am a professional videographer. That's what I do for a living. And since I own a professional camera, that's what I use for my vlogs. So this will not be a hands-on review. I will not be giving you actual footage from these cameras I'm about to recommend. Hopefully one day I'll be able to rent the cameras that I talk about but until then, please take my recommendations as a professional videographer. Because if I didn't have this camera, and I wanted to get the most awesome camera for my vlog, these are the cameras I would be considering. Alright, let's get right into my top cameras. These will be in the suspenseful order from 3 to 1, 3 being a fantastic choice, 1 being the most awesome choice. So, here we go. Number 3. This DSLR camera is a go-to for most people starting vlogs. The Canon Rebel T7i. Canon has been known to have some of the best cameras for photography, and yes, that fantastic image quality does transfer over to video. It meets all the tech specs I talked about in the last episode, and it even has a nice swing out LED viewing panel, as well as a mic line in. Speaking of that mic line in, I believe Canon has a package deal where you can get a nice road mic and SD card with the camera and the 18-55mm to lens. That's a fantastic little bundle, and this camera is my number three choice for an awesome vlog camera. Number two, the Nikon D5500. This is another DSLR camera, and it is a beast of a choice for your vlog. It has everything you'd want, it meets all the tech specs I talked about in the last episode, and is slightly cheaper than the Canon Rebel T7i. The main reason, however, that I would choose this camera over the Rebel T7i is because this D5500 has the ability to capture 1920 by 1080 video at 60p. A huge perk if you want the option to capture crisp, fast action videos like sports, or if you'll be wanting to slow the footage down to get a nice smooth slow motion look. The swing out LED panel certainly will come in handy as you can make sure you're framed upright and in focus all by yourself very easily. The image quality is excellent, and it even has a mic line in so you can pop on an external mic to capture the best audio. Love the camera there for vloggers, but if this one is a little bit out of your price range, take a look at their T3400. Just as good of a camera really, but it does not have a mic line in, nor does it have that nice swing out LED panel. Finally, we're at my number one top recommended awesome camera for your vlog. And guess what? It's a tie! <laughs> I know, I was just as excited as you are when I decided to have two cameras in my number one spot. Here's what happened. Initially, I decided that the Blackmagic Design Pocket Cinema Camera was going to be my top recommendation, and it is an amazing camera. And I do recommend it if you're also able to purchase a lens for it, as it is not sold with a lens. Also, this camera's compression formats are Apple ProRes 442 or .mov. It will not give you MP4 files. And the camera is clearly geared towards Mac users. And if that's you, great, seriously consider this camera. If you're a PC guy like me, then you'll understand why I decided to add another camera on to the top spot, alongside the Blackmagic camera, the Sony a7 II. This is an equally amazing camera. It does cost a little bit more than the Blackmagic, but you do have the option to purchase it from Sony with a lens and the ability to capture video at 60p. Professionally, I use a Sony camera, and so if I was going out to purchase an awesome camera specifically for my vlogs, it would be really hard to talk me out of purchasing another Sony camera. However, the Blackmagic Design Pocket Cinema Camera would be the only other camera I would consider, even though it doesn't have the compression format that I'd like, because you can always get around that stuff with video converters and whatnot. So, there you have it. Thanks so much for watching, I really hope this helped. If this helped you make a decision on an awesome camera for your vlog, let me know in the comments below what you decided to go with. Thanks again for watching, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and I will see you next week with my top three awesome lens recommendations.